Physics Toolbox Suite includes all of the different types of sensors your mobile device might have that you can collect data on. And right now you can see that there's a graph in the background that's running. And the way to find out exactly what kinds of sensors your mobile device has is to click on the multi-report. That'll give you a highlight of which things actually are in your device. Some simply just don't have them. So if you wanted to collect data, for example, we'll go back to our force meter graph. It's very simple. All that you have to do is to click on the floating plus button. You'll note that there um, is a pop-up down below that, that will say for a moment that your data is being recorded. When you're done, simply hit the stop, enter your test file name, and then you're able to send that off to yourself either through um, your email or through Drive or even to share that with another device. Now, depending upon where you are in the world, you might actually want to make some settings to how that data gets recorded and how it gets displayed in the CSV file. Um, for some people, you might want to use a comma, and for others, you might use a semicolon to delimit your data. So all you have to do is to click on that to select it. In addition to that, depending upon the kind of experience or, or uh, investigation that you're doing, you might actually use the local clock time um, as opposed to the elapsed time, which is going to be more common for data collection in uh, student experiences. You can also change the axes that are getting displayed as well as the line width and the sensor collection rate. So there's a whole bunch of different things and settings that you can kind of play around with. In addition to um, sensors that you can record data from, there's also a number of different types of generators that you can use in the science laboratory. So feel free to play around with those. Um, also, please be sure to check out verasoftware.net for example lessons, ideas, and also to contact us. Thank you very much.